to be named in that squad. OK, Andy, thanks very much indeed. Now, One Foot in the Grave, a fan? Yes, definitely. It's a great show, isn't it? And uh, you may not believe it, but One Foot in the Grave is more than 30 years old. The BAFTA award-winning comedy series, which starred Richard Wilson, of course, as the curmudgeonly Victor Meldrew and was filmed here in the South. It started in 1990 and there were 42 episodes and two feature-length specials. Now, one of those specials has been restored, so you can see it in high definition with a better picture quality than ever before. And last week, a screening event was held in Christchurch to raise money for children in need. Simon Marks went so long. 4291. <laughs> <laughs> In 1990, the BBC comedy series One Foot in the Grave introduced us to grumpy Victor Meldrew, his long-suffering wife Margaret and their friend Mrs Warboys. It's Mr Burkitt's dog, Nippy. <laughs> Nippy? <laughs> Doesn't look very nippy from where I'm standing. The show's exterior scenes were filmed on location in Bournemouth, Christchurch and New Milton. But for the 1993 Christmas special, the Meldrews and Mrs Warboys jetted off to Portugal to put one foot in the Algarve. So the three of us decided to rent a little villa and have a bit of a holiday for a couple of weeks. But of course, things don't go to plan. This is our villa. <laughs> The 90-minute special was shown on television in standard definition, but the film cameras used at the time captured the raw footage at a much higher quality, which has enabled a BBC team today to remaster the entire feature. Why don't you just bury me alive with a shovel and have done with it? This was a really big Christmas special, a 90-minute feature film, effectively. We've had it properly restored, we've taken all the dirt off, we've sharpened it up, and it looks better than it ever has done before, because originally it was edited on videotape, and that took down the quality. And I've always watched it and always thought, this looks a bit scrappy, we could do a good job with this, if only we could get hold of the original camera negatives, and we did. All those little bits of dirt and sparkle, which are basically bits of um, black dirt on the negative, which when reversed, goes white. So you see these little white flecks. They all had to be removed and that had to be done frame by frame. Because I've got better digital tools that they didn't have then, I can bring a lot more colour out of the flesh tones, for example, and the incredible beach scenes. They look much more naturalistic now. I think I'll go for a walk. Oh. Oh. Where are you? Superman's granddad. <laughs> After all that work, the restored film was shown on the big screen at the Regent Centre in Christchurch with a special guest, Mrs Warboys herself, the actress Doreen Mantle. I mean, it, he said we're going to have a summer holiday and we all, well, some of us, you go, oh, rah, 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 rah. <laughs> summer holiday. And we got down there and it was raining in the Algarve. It was miserably cold. But that was only the first couple of days. After that, it cleared up and it was wonderful. They say I might as well face the truth. It's absolutely brilliant. <laughs> really, really good. Fantastic. It's so long ago that it's funny again. It's brilliant. It's nice to have a jolly good laugh. And absolutely love it. We don't it. get any sense of humour like that anymore. No, it's a shame, Gone. really. Yeah. I yeah. wish they could bring it back. Yeah. <laughs> Donations raised over £1,000 for children in need. Surely even Victor would approve of that. Simon Marks, BBC South Today, Christchurch. One foot in a grave. Yeah, one foot in the grave, still raising a laugh 30 years on, and all for children in need too. Great to see. We're joined on the sofa by our very own Mrs Warboys. Oh, thank Alexis you. Alexis Green. <laughs> um, the weather is windy, pretty windy.